Hey, Jeff. Hey, Rick. You ever feel like you're just running in circles and the world is crumbling beneath you? Yes. Oh, me too. Literally or like emotionally? Yeah. Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah. Well, this is the D-pad, and I'm Rick. I'm Jeff. This is Sonic Origins Plus. We are wrapping up Amy Rose in Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles HD remake. Ow. Colon anniversary mode. Yeah, I guess that's true, too. I forgot about that part. Um, oh, actually, Death Egg Zone, I think, has... has I think Death Egg Zone has... Uh, Special stages. Special in stages. It? I could swear that it does. I I, I might be misremembering some that game. I could not tell you. Can we not? Can we not with that? Actually, it has some pretty good MVPs right now that have been uh, targeting you pretty effectively. <laughs> we got. We just got hired. Uh, <laughs> Robotic was saying that his other robots suck dicks, and we're the only ones that he can trust to actually uh, protect his fucking space station. <laughs> All the rest of them he hired off of uh, Fiber's list. Yeah. <laughs> I brought my resume, and he was really surprised. Yeah, I, apparently that's not all that common. I put a cover letter on it, and, they, and he was really happy about that. So, I don't know. It just seems like, kind of seems like all the rest of you guys suck ass. What weapon do you Big lose? Big wet ass? Um, I brought a gun. Oh, my God. He's a genius. It's really effective against creatures that live. <laughs> Sonic is faster than a speeding bullet, but not if he's running towards it. Yeah. Only if he's running directly away from it. It just hurts twice as much. Yeah, you just need a bit of a heads up first. I think normally you actually just want to jump past this because there's like rings and boxes and stuff, but whatever. Yeah, this is right the there. automatic way to get it done. If we were super, we, would, we wouldn't want to do this, but no. I mean, this is an easy way to get super if you uh, turn around and grab those, but also... Uh, oh, yo, whatever. Tails went and got us a ring box. Hey, buddy. Buddy thanks, boy. Thanks, man. Little buddy boy, man boy. Oh, thanks, boy. Yeah. Uh-oh. Well. Really? Um, really, though? Actually, yeah. What? But the thing is, is that I don't think so. Oh, my God. Fell ass first onto that spike. Okay, this is a good start. That one didn't make any sense. Hmm. Like, there was nothing to be squished against. I think I got... I think I rolled under the spikes and immediately died. Because you came out of the roll or something? I think so, yeah. I don't know. It sure looked like there was a lot of space. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Fine, Sonic. Uh. You got us. <laughs> I just want my super form so I can stop being so fucking touchy. Yes, and scared of losing rings. Don't do it, Tails! No! Oh, uh, my boy. Whoop. Eh, we got it. Close enough. Oh, yeah, this little eh, set of eh, stuff. There is eh. a, a checkpoint down into your left that you missed last time, but hopefully we just won't yeah, need I it this we'll time. See. We'll be all good. I mean, as long as you don't get the phantom pinch. Woohoo! Nice. Diggy, diggy, diggy. That's what you like to see. See, now I don't have to worry about getting hit, so I don't have to even dodge those fucking things. Yep. That was the problem, is I was trying to dodge, and then I got hit and damaged, and then got pushed underneath yeah, the spikes. Yeah, and then went there accidentally anyway, yeah. Again, I'm still pretty sure if you play that footage back, it looks like there should have been no way you could have possibly been squished. Pretty much. There's actually a pit here somewhere, right there. <laughs> this game is terrible, and Sonic 3 is the worst game ever. Oh, God. Hey, Jeff, do you smell smoke? Yeah. Oh, is that people burning down your house? Oh, no. We're not even in it yet. Yeah. Hot takes from the D-pad. Sonic 3's <laughs> a bad game. <laughs> oh, no. We're, if we're Jeff to, is experiencing some hard times. If we're trying to be tr Twitter trolls for money, maybe that would fly, but... Oh, God. Sploop, bloop, bloop. Personally. That's what I always say. Sploop, bloop, bloop. <laughs> Fuck that. Sonic 3, not in the top 50 best platformers in the world. <laughs> there we go. It's not even in the top one Sonic games. You want a classic platformer? Let's talk Bubsy. Oh, God. 3D. Yeah. Or Gex. 
All right, time to almost die with the shit that he pulls out here. This is notorious uh, for just killing you in super forms because it crushes you underneath if you're not yeah, careful. As it spins around. Yep. Don't that do was that anymore. Every time it happens to Tails, I get freaked out. Yep. Bing. Where All did right. I get a sign of my face? Now, who keeps making these? They're very accurate. Is, I'm adorable. Is Robotnik making them? <laughs> You're adorable. <laughs> <laughs> You're my favorite. <laughs> You're the one I hate the least. too. <laughs> All right. Also, what are you doing this week? No, that's weird. Sorry. Yeah, never mind. Don't worry about that. I, we can be associates. That's fine. No, yes. it's, it's really not a big deal. <laughs> Just immediately started thinking back to our Breath of the Wild. Or, uh, sorry, Tears of the Kingdom uh, session. Oh, God. Everybody decided Link was a sexy little guy. Hey, you got one big fucking hog there, buddy. I just noticed that you're packing. <laughs> You got a meat packing plant in there, my dude. Congratulations. Link, could I just thunder up on your beef tower? <laughs> I'm about to learn some new recipes for love. <laughs> you know, sometimes when you think of a joke and it's terrible, but it makes you laugh anyway. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I may as well say it because it's a deep act. Oh, yeah. Hey, you know, oh, hero of time, more like the hero of about to come on my face, please. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. And I was like, that's not even a good joke, <laughs> first just, of all. That's just, like, gross for the sake of gross. Yes, it's like. not clever. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, of course, why it made me laugh, but... Oh, God. There, There's there's a, a there's room for good, like, anti-jokes, for sure. Oh, definitely. Uh, Whoa, that was close. That's fine. Hoop. Okay, we're good. We're good. Hero of painting my face. <laughs> <laughs> At least oh, that's more no, this prick is over here. Constructed. That's not good. Well, you got plenty of time to do it while it. Yeah. Ugh, except it does that when it actually sees oh, you. Oh, it attempts pokies? Yeah. It is not just a pretty face. It's also got pokies. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. That was stupid. Maybe we a little got early. got story about here. Yeah. Well, let's see. Especially because you just had exactly 50 rings. Oh, let's send that down. Skip this shit. Actually, what I should do is when we get to the very end, right before the boss, I should go into that uh, that bonus stage and actually do the because uh, that'll pull me out rings. of super mode, and I can get more rings too. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. It's not the worst idea. Super mode is almost completely useless against the first phase of the boss stuff here. Yeah. And is infinitely more useful against the other the other bosses. Yeah, so if you can help it, you want to save it. Yeah. I have to assume we're not doing the Doomsday Zone. Relatively sure that it's going to end with Death Egg Zone Act 2. That Amy wouldn't do Doomsday? Yeah. Hmm. That has that thus far been exclusively a hypersonic stage. Actually, technically, you can do it as supersonic. Uh, if you can manage to not lose the Chaos Emerald, there is a way. I think if you Oh, quit, is this like a sequence break bug kind of thing? A little, sort of, kind of. I, I forget if you have to, like, save and quit in Mushroom Hill Zone or something before getting boxed into. Or you can just walk away from the giant, the giant ring. The trick is you have to never go into a giant ring because oh. that will mandatorily... I think that's actually our thing. Split it will them mandatorily all and do that weird thing. Yeah. yeah. Oh, ring jackpot bar, perfect. Oh man. Whoop. Three different things came up. Sweet, that's the best thing yeah. to happen. It's the best hand in poker. Mm. Three unrelated <laughs> cards. Yeah. We call that a, a flunch. Triple up. Oop. Not to be confused with the Pokemon. <laughs> there we go. Not Robotnik, not Robotnik. Hey, it's our buddy. Hooray, tails and tails and tails. We'll do and one knuckles. more and then we're out of here. Amy! For two. <laughs> Boo. Let's do one more because we got two. Our face gave us the fewest rings. <laughs> yeah. Shenan. I, I noticed there's no Sonic in there, too. Oh, oh. Yeah. 
Uh, God damn it. Whatever. We got we got enough. 77 is enough if you don't activate it. Yeah. The real question is, do I have a shield right now? Uh, I do. Okay, yeah. good. That's the thing that I'm really being the most cautious about. Is like, I'd, If I didn't have a shield, I would probably just let this... Uh, I would probably just go super for this just for the sake of not uh, getting screwed over by... Uh, the zappies. Yeah. Bonk. Ooh, wow, he got fast. Worked out pretty well, though. Yep. Boss isn't going to be timed right. Go nope. back to the left. Uh. Oh, what? That works? Oh, you can bounce them into him. I didn't know that was mm -hmm. a thing. Yeah. Used to be, uh. too. You thread the needle. Got him. And literally nice. every time we play a Sega Genesis game on the channel, yeah. it makes me want to play Shining Force. Oh, man, Just yeah. the sound of the sound font. Go. I'd have to say Shining Force 2 is probably like my favorite game and the one I played the most on Sega Genesis. Uh, hi, Tails. Where are you going, buddy? Wait, wow, he's so fast. <laughs> Holy shit. Where's I this just, been? Yeah, I was like, wait, what happened? Have oh you been God. just sandbagging Sonic for the last bunch of years? Right. All right, let's do this. Do you think your favorite Sega Genesis game specifically would be a Sonic title? Um, Probably. I would have to really think about it. Genesis was mostly just a Sonic machine for me. Yep. Yeah, strangely, like, I played Sonic and nice. Sonic 2, and then I don't think I ever owned and Knuckles. My friend Emily Ooh, did. Ooh, all right. So that's how I ended up playing that, but... Yeah, I would have to really think about the Genesis games I actually owned. Like, I think Aladdin on the Genesis was one of one of the ones I liked. Oh, I had, yeah, Aladdin on the Super Nintendo. I had both. It was... I can never tell oh. them apart. Because they are two completely different games. Yeah, I, I think they're they're built quite differently. Oh yeah, uh, different companies, everything. I um, I think a lot of the Sega Genesis games that I played were like not the super popular ones. Yeah, like there was a a, a not Dark Crystal called it was called Dark Waters. Okay. You hear that, like, it was like a cartoon show, I think. I don't know, now i got to look it up. I forget if it was a movie or not, but it was, like, kind of piratey, and there was water that was, like, <sighs> black and, like, oily, and it was, like, a monstrous sort of deal. I do not remember. It's called Dark Water. I, ugh, that part always makes me so nervous. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. There we go. Ba-boom. Ah. The Pirates of Dark Water. Okay, all right. It was based on a Hanna-Barbera 1991 cartoon series of the same name. Damn. Have you ever heard of the Pirates of Dark Water? No. It's totally new to me. All right, next D-pad and chill. There we go, yeah. And no Doomsday Zone, just the ending. Well, Amy doesn't fuck around. She got the emerald, she's out. Yeah, she looked adorable doing it. Yep. Sonic didn't do shit. Didn't even stain her dress. Tails barely did anything, yeah. but I guess he's driving, so I don't know. Credit to that. <laughs> I would almost be uh, like, it would almost make more sense if Sonic was flying the plane for this, because he does occasionally fly the plane. If Tails is doing stuff, Sonic will sometimes fly the plane. Yeah, I think he knows enough to like hold the controls. <laughs> yeah. All right, I know how to go straight and how to not go straight. That's about the the extent of my abilities, Tails. If I don't. If I don't do anything, I'm doing it correctly. Yeah. Tails just lets him sit in the cockpit, but he disables the controls. <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> it's on autopilot the whole time. There's an AI doing it. Yeah. Tails is just asleep in the plane. <laughs> I mean, that would make sense why it crashes so often. That's it's true. Autopilot and Tails is asleep. I figured out how to make your emerald stand perfectly straight up. Shit, I Bye. forgot to ask their names. <laughs> I'm going to have to go hunt them down later. Who the fuck were they again? Uh, Pinky, Orange Boy, and... They, they said there was like a, uh, a dead ghost or something that was with them? Some yeah. blue guy? I don't know what that's all about. Yeah. Mega Man? No. No, was it... Was it oh, Luigi, that's what it was. Yeah. The blue one's name was Luigi, I think. <laughs> 
Oh, man. So there we go. That's Sonic 3 and Knuckles with Amy. Um, nice. By and large, Sonic 3 and Knuckles in particular basically feels like just Sonic with a bigger Insta Shield and not hypersonic powers. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we do, we at the D-pad here need the, the the smallest of reasons to play through the Sonic Classic games again. It's true. I, I'm enough a fan of them that it's like, oh, yeah, fine, why not? And if there's even something that's slightly different that's, yep. like, exciting, but this really was just, like, barely different. Yeah. Like, I mean, you were controlling it, obviously, so you know more about the, the yeah, feel I mean, of it, but... Amy ultimately feels like in, like playing as easy mode Sonic yeah, for yeah. all these. That, that hammer spin is just extra powerful. Yeah. Well, also, outside of Sonic 3, nobody else has that ability in the first place. Sonic has a tiny insta-shield. Amy's is much bigger. Yes. Um, yeah, I mean, that's how you basically killed all the bosses. Yeah, because I was like, all right, I can take advantage of that for extra reach or to dive at... Um, here's our music, guys. Sirocco. Uh, or dive at... Um, yeah, Rip Sirocco. Yeah. He actually died kind of recently. Some, I think... Yeah, um, somewhat recently, right? Yeah. I think uh, one of the other ones did as well. I forget if it was Bobby Brooks or uh, Howard Drossen. Mm, no, not Howard Drossen. Oh my God, I forget. Two, two of them uh, died within the past three years, unfortunately. So big rip. Yes. Um, but yeah, no. It, it, Amy ultimately feels like easy mode Sonic, which isn't out of character for her. That's kind of the way that it worked in Sonic Heroes. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I was kind of hoping that they might have some unique paths for her or that they might do something interesting with Hyper Amy, which they didn't even do. Nope. They didn't call out that you could become Super Amy in the Sonic 3 portion, and then when you get all the Super Emeralds, it becomes Super Amy, who is identical to what she was doing before, and it was like, I feel like we missed something here. Mm-hmm. So I don't know. Deb McCracken. Good old Deb McCracken. Deb McCracken. Uh, but yeah, no, I mean, it's, it's always nice to have an excuse to play through the classics. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, I guess. Uh, wait, wait, what's the sprite we're gonna have here? Oh, we got the super transformation. Okay, again. so she cute. did finish super. I mean, that's kind of cute. Yeah. She can't fly, canonically, while she's in no. super mode. So I don't know what's about to happen immediately after it's this, just but the dolphins whack her out of the air. <laughs> oh no! There we go. I was like, what button do I hit? Start specific or plus rather? And Amy's on the the big logo this time. Cute. That's very cute. Do we get the animation? Ooh. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, there we go. All right, yeah. It's okay. the standard one, including the Doomsday Zone bot that he dr that he rides around in, which we didn't even see here. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> no, no, no. No, don't do it. I wish I wasn't so fat. <laughs> Finn is what he will wish that he had so he could swim more easily. Yes, Finn, as in his life has ended. Yeah. Because he drowned at sea. Well, I'm curious. I think surprise is... I was like, we had to have gotten more than one of these. Okay. Play one Game Gear title. Play as Amy and destroy one Metal Sonic hologram in Sonic CD. Okay. Save the future, and these are Knuckles in Sonic CD. Yeah, yeah, it's playing as Knuckles. Oh, this one's Amy Destroy the Amy Hidden or. Eggman statue in Wacky Workbench Zone 1. So I figure before we're properly done, we'll grab these, because, like, whatever. Like, it's, this means turn it on and turn it off. Yeah. And this is just go through uh, Palm Tree Panic and get one of those, which one I think time, is in the... Yeah. Bad future? We have level select, right, for the games we've completed? Uh, I don't recall outside of Sonic... Uh, I don't think we do outside of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Uh. But honestly, like... Yeah, that's the thing is, like, we'll... We, so we're going to do Knuckles in Sonic CD because he actually properly has new paths to go through. Hmm. Um, and there's also stuff for him anyway, but... I figure uh, we'll just... When we get to Wacky Workbench Zone 1, we'll just look around more carefully for that, I guess. We'll get. We'll we'll do this before we're done. There's also some new missions there as well. But when we come back next time, we're gonna dive back into Sonic CD with Knuckles. Hooray! Sonic CD and Knuckles. Yeah, Sonic CD and Knuckles. At long last, it's only taken uh, 31 years. Yeah, we finally got there. Yep. So uh, we'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>